is like. Um, as I've always indicated, the matter is being handled by career agents and investigators uh, with the Department of Justice. They've had it since the beginning. Uh, they are independent. Which predates your, which predates your tenure as it, Attorney General. It predates my tenure as Attorney General. It is the same team, uh, and they are acting independently. They follow the law. They follow the facts. That team will make findings. That is to say, they will, make, they will come up with a chronology of what happened, the factual scenario. They will make recommendations as to how to resolve what those facts lead to. Um, those, the, the recommendations will be reviewed by career supervisors in the Department of Justice and in the FBI and by the FBI director. Uh, and then, as is the common process, they present it to me, and I fully expect to accept their recommendations. Before President Clinton boarded your plane in Arizona, had you already made the determination that what you're announcing today was indeed what you were going to do? Yes, I had already determined that that would be the process. Well, look, as I've said, um, you know, he said hello, and we, we basically said hello, and I congratulated him on his grandchildren, as people tend to do. Look, as I've said, you know, just I may have viewed it in a certain light, but the issue is how does it impact the work that I do and the work that the Department of Justice does? And I, was, I certainly wouldn't do it again. <laughs> um, and, um, you know, because I think it has cast this shadow over what it should not, over what it will not touch. And that's why